Kyle Rittenhouse flees stage after face-off with booing protesters. The Daily Beast Mark Hertzberg, Getty Images Kyle Rittenhouse, who became a darling of the right after bleeping three protesters in 2020, hightailed it off a stage at the University of Memphis on Wednesday night as a C. Route of demonstrators booed him. Video from the event showed several protesters in black t-shirts in attendance. One of them stood up and questioned Rittenhouse about Charlie Kirk, the far-right conservative active East whose youth organization, Turning Point USA, sponsored Rittenhouse's appearance. Below are your comments. I find it interesting that conservatives believe their message is popular enough to hold these rally s only to find out the complete opposite when the event occurs. Same will happen in November. Polls may say they have a great chance. Mostly because they can be manipulated and often are. The verses. What Kyle is going to inevitably experience is his gradual abandonment by the folks who rallied Behi. Endy him when it was of use to their narrative. Now that the subject has changed and his usefulness has passed, very few of those people will remain to sing his praises. The doors he thought would be oh. Some folks don't seem to understand that free speech includes the right to respond to other free speech. ECH, and that includes booing someone. If I had done what Rittenhouse did I would be seeking a survivor island to live on, not show up on C. Olage campuses for speaking engagements and fees. So what does Rittenhouse talk about? I mean, whether he was right or not, it seems to me that getting up on stage and telling people that they have the right to buy a gun, get in the car with it, drive hours to put oneself in danger, the and bleep people who threaten them is not a please subscribe to my channel. And if you like it, please thumbs up.